you can change the world. Of course you can change the world because there isn't anyone else here to do it. There's just you and there's me. And what is greater is when we join together, obviously. And there's many, you and me. And when I say that, I mean just your average person. Our strength is in numbers. There are billions of us. And our strength is in numbers, only when we join together. And this vlog is about that joining together. You can change the world from the greater to the smaller in these two ways these two steps are what are absolutely required knowing this makes anything indeed possible not in like a fanciful way but in a practical way knowing that to change the world first we need to have a number of people to come together and then we lead to look at from the greater to the smaller. Uh, that's the saying, so I said it that way. But actually what we would do is first look at the smaller, and then we would look at the greater. And in these two ways, how this is how change will occur. Change will occur point by point. Which seems, especially to this little energy addict, dull, boring, kind of like, you mean I have to actually sit here and do this work? But yes, it will be point by point, just as the mess that's here on Earth was made point by point. And when we start looking at, when I say the small, so from the great to the small, but we're going to look at the small first, that would mean I must, as an individual part of the great numbers of human beings that are required to come together, I am one. So I must first look at and within myself and make the necessary alignments, corrections, look at myself self-honesty, face myself. Of course I have to face myself. How can I be part of a solution so great as to change the world if I'm not self-corrected, if, if I'm not a part of the new, as the old will slip away and the new will come to be. An old world must leave, and a new one must come. But I am part of the old world right now. I, I can't fake it. I mean, you can fake it, but it won't work. Look, we've been faking it. It's not working very well. So I must strip away, or peel away, like the onion, the different layers of myself, and sanding. And everything in this life that I have lived and learned as a mind, I need to look at the mind what's talking away inside my head, what I've learned through experiences, which I carry with me as past, as time, and forgive it. And then after I do this, after I look at myself and remake me as part of the new world, I can See, truly see, self-realize, truly see my world. So I'm no longer plagued with and imprisoned by the mind of the inner chatter, the voices, the memories, the pictures in your mind, imaginations that are keeping me completely occupied all day, every day. Even at night, right? Your dreams. Then I'll be able to see the outer, the greater, my world. And you know, it's funny because 
sometimes that's kind of scary, you know, to let go of the old because you don't know what the new is going to be. But when you stop the mind, we know we're able to stop the mind, breathe through your thoughts, and we're still here. And we can see we're okay. We don't actually require the mind. So when I am clear and I actually have some stability, I've let go of a lot of emotions and feelings and anxieties, and I am here stable with my breath, then I'm ready and able to see what is required. But actually these two things can be done at the same time. And the reason I'm going through all this is to also introduce to the idea of a solution. And looking at myself first is something that I am learning about at Destiny. And at the same time, becoming part of a solution. And the solution for this world is the smaller. First of all, look at self. And then with the greater, as the billions of people can join and have much power in a vote in a democracy, is to implement an equal money system. And you can read about this and investigate and learn about it at Equal Money Org. And there is a wiki page to answer many, many questions. There's also a forum. You can ask questions. You can contribute your ideas and thoughts um, are very welcome and encouraged. So from the small, which would be myself, uh, interestingly actually the small is also a universe though, the human physical body is a universe, and the destiny I'm learning about that universe as my body learning about what the mind is, so I can shut it up, know what and who I am, so I can become an effective, directed person, to the greater, become part of all, and contribute to the all. And that first step being to implement an equal money system as a solution to changing the world. Thank you.